Hey guys, welcome to A Thiefness in the Middle East. I am in Taqwa Mosque in Tripoli, Lebanon. It's a very religious uh, part of Lebanon, um, quite uh, Sunni in its uh, residence. The women behind me have husbands, sons, brothers in Rumye that are accused of terrorism or being in what any group would like sort of ISIS, Qaeda, Nusra, or even more local groups. Uh, the sister social workers are working with a group out of DC called ICANN to really understand how these women are sort of related uh, to these extremist groups. To what degree do they sympathize? To what degree do they renounce? To what degree do women in general have a say in how these groups are sort of running in these cities? Um, and a lot of times the videos that I bring you on a Fiefness in the Middle East are unique because I'm led into parts of mosques in, in really conservative towns simply because the Yamuts or uh, myself just have really Sunni names. And so they look at us as part of their community and they let us in and they let us tape. And this is not very, this is quite rare, right? This is not something that's very easy to do. So uh, yeah, this is what we're doing today. We're trying to take the information of these women um, and understand what their sort of unique path has been, whether they are claiming due process issues, whether they're claiming um, lack of evidence issues, um, and just really trying to see how we can understand their story and work with them to get information to just understand more about how these societies and these structures work. So um, you can see behind me the, the sisters grouping off and taking a lot of information. I really appreciate you coming to the to, to the space to a Fiefness in the Middle East. I try to bring you unique stories and just show you what's going on in the ground. So uh, I'll talk to you soon.